Okay. Hi. Let me set my hair really quick. Looks nice. Uh, I need to look nice for my mom. She's like, your hair wasn't good. Uh, your shirt wasn't good. So I have to be like up top whenever I'm making a video. All right, guys. Welcome to another video. In this video, I'm talking about what things I carry in my carry-on, uh, what bag I use, what suitcase I use, what I keep in my backpack, and why I keep those things. If you're not following me on Instagram, do follow me on Instagram, please. All right, let's get into the video. The first thing, the, my backpack, I've been using this backpack for three years now. Uh, this is a VIP backpack, pretty normal. You might think that why is this guy using VIP, but I really like this. There's a rain cover in the back zip here. So you can take that out, put it on the back in case of rains, if you're coming from college and it's raining outside, which happens a lot in Indiana, uh, then everything is safe inside. Just a lot of pockets, really good backpack. I've traveled to Sweden, Thailand, uh, us with this one so it's superb norway as well helsinki finland russia also added this back so it's a really really good backpack the first thing which i put is the amazon basics case it costs around 700 rupees i have a couple of hard disk and small card reader uh, some cables which i keep in it and it keeps everything really safe it's a hard case so it won't break if you're putting a lot of pressure it won't bend as well it just keeps a lot of things and it keeps my backpack clean which is really nice the first hard disk which i ever bought was a wd western digital and i've been buying hard disk from western digital after that i have a one tb hard disk two tb hard disk and a four tb hard disk i've been filling out hard disk really fast because of these vlogs moving on the small camera which you see on the screen right now is the YI action camera um, i was planning to go for a gopro but gopros are expensive this cheapest GoPro is like 200. This is only 100 bucks. If you want to make vlogs, uh, even if you want to shoot water proof inside the ocean or inside a pool, works really good. Check it out. Next thing is my computer. I've been using a MacBook Air since three years. It's a 2015 MacBook Air, a 256 gig model with a four gigs of RAM. I've been using it for video editing and just normal work. I really like MacBook. I'm a Apple Mac fan. I don't think I'm gonna go back to Windows now. For documents, you can use an envelope, but I use the FedEx envelope, which comes with your i20. You can use a nice document folder to keep all of your stuff. I keep my i20, extra copy of passport, extra copy of maybe some of my IDs, a credit card maybe, all of that in that. Wireless headphones. The big ones you see here are the Motorola Pulse Escape. They were gifted to me. I've been using it for a month and a half now. They're good, they're a little tight on my ear, but they're good. The next earphones, which I use really often, which you might have seen in my pictures as well, is the House of Marley, Bluetooth Smile Jamaica earphones. They are really, really good. They sound nice. They don't hurt your ear. They're a bit on the expensive side, but I think they're totally worth it. And they look really cool. Do I look cool? I think I look cool. Yeah. I'm using a Joby tripod for my camera. Joby tripods are expensive. You can get the cheap ripoff version for like 600 rupees. The Joby ones are like five times of that. I always keep a book with me. So when I was flying from Delhi to Dubai, uh, I didn't have entertainment center. So those TVs, right? It was paid in Fly Dubai. Not cool Fly Dubai. No. But anyway, so in those cases, when your phone is not working, when you don't have your entertainment center with you, you can have a book have a good read. I have a small notebook where I keep addresses and phone numbers of people. Just in case if my phone gives up on me, I'm very, very cautious in these cases. So I keep some phone numbers and addresses in that just in case I need them physically. I keep a pen along with to fill out the forms. Whenever you are entering US or whenever you're entering any country, they'll give you an immigration form or a customs form which you'll have to fill. Moving on two wallets what's the secret behind two wallets i keep one wallet with indian money i keep one wallet with us money and as soon as i land here i'll just pick that wallet up and go on with my life i keep one card here one card here just in case i lose my main wallet all right two phones what's the story behind two phones why would i keep two phones the reason being what if you lose your phone your phone gets stolen you have one more phone uh, also it keeps my sim safe so i keep my indian sim in one phone and my us sim in another phone next up to charge those two phones you need a power bank mi power bank i've been using it for 
टू थ्री टू ईयर्स ना इट्स अ ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड एम एच पावर बैंक वर्क वेरी नाइस इट हैज़ टू यू एस बी पोर्ट्स सो आई कैन चार्ज टू फोन एट द सेम टाइम एंड वन चार्ज विल गिव यू लाइक सिक्स टू सेवन चार्ज ऑन योर फोन आई एम ऑलवेज ऑन द इंटरनेट आई एम ऑलवेज ऑन द इंस्टाग्राम आई एम ऑलवेज ऑन माई फोन सो आई नीड दीज काइंड ऑफ थिंग्स नेक्स्ट आप माई होम कीज Why wouldn't I take my home keys? My home keys is there's a tile device attached to it. A tile is a small device with GPS inside it, so your phone can track it. Uh, you can see where you lose them, and if you, in case you can't find them, you can just trigger the alarm and it will start ringing, and you can find them now. Next up, I'm wearing specs most of the time, so I keep a case. Just in case, I'll have to remove them, wear my lenses, so that I can keep those. lenses and the specs in the case a small toothpaste and toothbrush for the same reason nice thing emirates emirates etihad and i think qatar is also is also doing this they're giving toothpaste and toothbrush even in economy which is which is a nice gesture i guess some cash why because you never know your cards might work or might not work next up mi band i stole this mi band uh, from my father and how could i even forget my passport the only thing which matters the most uh, yeah so keep your passport you can put a nice envelope on it uh, i wear a shirt sometimes when i'm traveling so i can there's a pocket right here right i can keep that passport in there i'm a maniac and i always think that i'm going to lose my passport i'm always 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 scared about it i carry a charger hub it can charge five devices at once and one with quick charge works really good if i have to charge three phones at once and i only have one plug on the wall universal travel adapter extremely important to so i'm going to leave a link of a cheaper one in the description below you can check it out next up uh, extension cord why an extension cord you would ask an extension cord is really important if you have a lot of things to plug in and if all of your chargers and plugs are of indian standards and not us standards so through one travel adapter you can just plug in the extension cord and charge four devices or use four devices at once through indian adapters oh there you go such a eureka moment right anyway i travel with extension cord in every time my camera charger for lp 17 canon i'm using a 750d that's my camera right there can you see it can you see it yeah that's the lamp behind it but i always keep an eye mask i always keep an eye mask with me because it just helps me keep me sleeping a water bottle it's extremely important why would you carry a water bottle because you never know if you're traveling from air india they might not even give you water very bad reviews were in india anyway keep a water bottle keep it empty um, just lose all the water and keep it empty I got really thirsty after speaking so much. Some aspirins as well, some stomach ache medicines. Always carry them just in case. If you have asthma, uh, carry your sprayer with you. If you have some other diseases, always keep medicine and always keep your prescription with you as well, just in case they stop you at customs, which they might. I don't know why they do it. And now you might be thinking, how can this person fit so much stuff in this small backpack? Well, I don't. I have a suitcase as well, so I keep this suitcase with me. It's a Carlton bag. Uh, it's a really, really nice suitcase. Small size, smaller than the actual carry-on size, but I bought this thoughtfully that I don't have to trouble anyone, and it's small enough that I even if I travel domestic, I can carry it easily with me. I keep like two pairs of shirts, two pairs of pants. maybe a couple of socks a small towel if i need to shower i get long jackets i need to shower if my flight is too long um and just keep like keep my backpack light keep some stuff in there all right guys that's all i have for you today if you have any more tips for carry on just comment down below so that i'll be useful for other people as well and if you'd like to buy anything i'm going to leave all the links in the description so you can check them out thank you guys so much for watching this video until then i'll see you in the next one Peace. Wow, seven minutes.